What's up, what's up, what's up, YouTube? This your man, Skins fan, all day, all day, all day. A red skin fan, all day. Um, what's good? What is good? Let's see. Do y'all believe me now, red skin fans? Red skin fans out there, do y'all believe me now? Everything that Skins fan yours truly has been saying it's coming to light guys so do skins fans know what he's talking about yes all the red skin fans out there that saw the game last night was y'all pissed probably yes was i no i see was i see the writing on the wall um jay gruden of course he doesn't care he doesn't care um you see what he's doing to Adrian Peterson. Um, purposely not running him. Third and one. Fourth and one. You're giving the ball to little old Chris Thompson. And you're putting the ball in Case Keenum hand. Like I said again, guys. Case Keenum stinks. Everybody, oh, Skins fan, Skins fan. Case Keenum, is he's, he's playing good. I said, I don't give a crap about that. I said, when will the real Case Keenum show up? He showed up tonight. I'm telling y'all, with this coaching staff that we got now and the I don't care attitudes that they uh, that Jay Gruden got, guys, I don't see us winning a game this year. Have y'all have y'all Redskins fans ever seen a Washington team go 0-16? Have y'all? No. Have y'all ever seen Washington Redskins not win a game no. You might see it this year. You might see it this year. Um, unless, unless Jay Gruden get fired, unless Greg Manessi get fired, unless Bruce Allen get fired, you might see it this year. We are going, like I said, guys, you can go back, check my videos. Like I said, we are going to lose to the Eagles. We're going to lose to the Giants. We're going to lose to the Cowboys. We're going to lose to the Bears. We're going to lose to the Patriots. We're going to lose to the Dolphins. And so on. Until something happened. We're going 0-6. Y'all don't have to believe me. If y'all pay attention to the games, look at what Jay Gruden is doing. He do not care. He do not care. He's basically, he's taking our best players, Adrian Peterson, our best running back for sure, he's not running him on purpose. So that tells you right there, he's not trying to win, guys. That tells you he don't want to win. I don't like AP. I don't give a crap how good he is. I don't give a crap what record he's trying to break. He's not going to run in my offense. So you putting personal attacks before your team. Personal attacks before you're, before you're trying to win. That's a bad coach right there. Everybody keep talking about Josh Norman getting burnt up, getting burnt up. Yes, he's getting burnt up. That's play calling. The reason why I say play calling because Greg Minuski is not calling the right scheme. You got to put players, you got to put players to fit the scheme. You got to, you got to, basically you got to put the scheme to, to fit the players. Josh Norman is not a cover man. He's not. He's he's not a he's not a man to man. He's basically what I'm saying. He's not man to man. Josh Norman never been a good man to man. He's a zone. He's a zone uh, defender. You put Josh Norman in a zone, he's good. You put him on one on one, he's not good. He's gonna get burnt up, and that's what's being displayed. Greg Minuski. Greg Minuski don't give a crap. He don't care. Um. It's mind-boggling, guys, to, to sit back and watch this stuff. And I still hear people talking about this, the players this, the players this, the players that. It's not the players, guys. It's the coaches. The coaches are the problem. The coaches are the problem. If I was Trent, if I was Trent Williams, I wouldn't come back either. That brother knows. I wouldn't come back. He probably don't want to come back because he don't want Jay there. He don't want Bruce there. 
It probably don't have anything to do with money. But they're not going to put that out there um, to, uh, to the media. He don't want the coaches. I believe he don't want the coaches there. I'm telling y'all guys, this thing is going to get ugly before it get better. Until Daniel Snyder put his foot down and he said, you know what? I got to make a change. I got to man up and make a change. He's obviously he's scared right now. I don't know what's going on with Daniel Snyder. Bruce Allen trash. Jay Gruden suck. Worst coach ever. I'd rather have Jim Zorn back. At least he tried. I'd rather have Jim Zorn back than everybody. I like Jay. I like Jay. I don't like Jay. How can you like a coach that don't care about winning? He do not care. Y'all saw. Y'all saw the first three games of the season. This guy do not care about winning. He's taking personal attacks against AP. He putting personal attacks before the team. He don't want to win. You got to suck that up. You got to man up and say, look, we deal with our stuff behind scenes, but while we on this field, we're going to play and try to win. He don't want to hear he, He's not doing that. He's not doing that at all. So Jay Gruden got to go. He got to go. If we all can see it, I know Daniel Snyder and Bruce Allen see it also. I'm telling y'all, we might not win a game this year. Be prepared. Buckle up. Buckle up, guys. That's why I said before, hashtag boycott Redskin Games. Y'all remember that? I did say hashtag boycott Redskin Games. This is the reason why. Hashtag boycott Redskin Games. Like I said before, if we don't stand up as Redskin fans, if we don't stand up as Redskin fans, guys, no change is going to happen. We got to stop showing up. We got to stop showing up to these games. That's why I haven't been. I'm not going. I got invited to a game. No, I'm not going. I'm not going for what? I don't want to go see my team live playing a real game and the coaches don't give a crap. He taking out personal attacks on one player doing a live game on live TV. I don't want to be there. I don't want to go and see that. I'm already watching it on TV. Why would, I, why would I want to go see it live? Skins fan not mad at all. I've been telling y'all, Redskins is not going to be what y'all think we are, what y'all thought we was going to be. But don't nobody want to listen to Skins fan all day because Skins fan all day don't know what you're talking about. I know what I'm talking about. I'm not a delusional fan. If you watch, if you watch and pay attention to what's going on with the players, watch their faces. I'm a very observant person. You watch their faces. You watch their body language. They don't want to play. I'm telling you. Jay Gruden don't give a crap. Only thing he worrying about, I need to target AP and that's it. That's my goal. Target AP. Man, I don't know, man. It's hard being a Redskins fan, guys. It's really it. It's sickening. It's sickening. It's hard to be a fan. It's hard. Really hard. The, the, his decisions that he's making, I don't, I just don't understand. I don't understand. You got Trey Quinn, he got Trey Quinn back there returning punts instead of having Sims back there returning punts. That boy's electrifying. He's way better than um Trey Quinn. But hey, who who am I to say? I'm not the coach. But look, guys, um, I just want to come over here and share some things with you guys. Um. You agree to agree to disagree. Um, make sure you leave a comment down the bottom. Share out this video. Share out this video, guys. Let me know what you think. Tell me your feelings. Tell me your thoughts of how you think the season going to go. What the final record going to be? Um, anybody new that's watching this, make sure you join my channel. Comment, like, subscribe. Um, turn on notifications so when I put up a video, you don't miss anything. Um, it's crazy. It's crazy. But make sure, guys, for all y'all pissed fans this morning, make sure you keep your head up <laughs> and don't let nobody steal your joy. Because Jay already stole everybody's joy. Jay. But don't let nobody steal your joy. Until we meet again, guys, this your Man Skins fan all day. Peace. Y'all have a blessed evening.